27 year old Tim Pichot is a member of the first wave triathletes. I was just out here doing a 40 minute swim. And... Thursday, he's out on Lake Pleasant after a long break. I hadn't been out here in three weeks. Just preparing for the next Ironman competition when he spotted something strange out of the corner of his eye. Well, hard to gauge what was going on. And though Tim was on the dock, done with his swim, more than 100 yards away, he saw the victim's friends waving for help. And that's when he dove in and started swimming. So I ran off this dock, jumped in the water, uh, got to the gentleman in distress. But even Tim thought it was too late. Checked his pulse. I didn't see a pulse, uh, didn't see him breathing. I saw his eyes in the back of his head. His skin was turning white. As a former lifeguard, however, Tim knew he still had to try to help save the man's life. I knew I just had to keep doing compressions until the professionals got here. 10 minutes later, with help on scene and the victim with a faint pulse. And we noticed that he did get a heart beat again. Uh, there's some very shallow breathing. Tim let the paramedics take over, saying he's glad he was at least able to help a stranger in trouble. It's a situation no one wants to be in, but if you're in that situation, I think it's your duty just as a good person to, to act. And I just hope he's doing okay. Now, the great news tonight is that the victim is expected to be okay. In fact, a spokesperson for the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office says that person was rushed here to John C. Lincoln Hospital last night in, get this, stable condition. And had it not been for Tim, that person would likely have died. We're live here in North Phoenix, Greg Argos, CBS 5 News. Great ending to that story.